Hello, and this is Saturday Morning Recorded, and I'm your host, Cohen Vogel, and for today's special guest, that's my friend, Carly Comstock. For your weekly tidbit of news, it's that scientists have found out that cows' brains have actually gotten smaller from when they were wild and undomesticated. They had larger brains then than they do now, which is quite strange. They also figured out the more tamer cows, like dairy cows, have the smallest brains of all the cows. Very interesting. Here's your special guest. This week's special guest is my friend, Carly Comstock. So for your first question, it will be, how did you get interested in show choir? Um, so I got interested when my sister got in, I was in second grade, and my mom took me to watch uh, Center Stage. And so I sat in the in like the middle and I grabbed my Cheetos and I, and I would judge all the show choirs actually as a kid. And ever since then, I've absolutely loved it. It's just the energy, it's, it's incredible. Now, one of our show choir competitions, you received an award for being one of the best vocalists. So what was that like? It was... It was insane. Yeah, like I was, we were all so dead tired that like it didn't really hit me. So at first uh, I, I went up to receive it and I was just like, oh my gosh, what's going on? And I got it and then everyone started chanting my name and it was just, it was just so incredible. It was, it was awesome. Now you're also a varsity player on tennis. Do you notice any similarities between tennis and show choir? Yeah, for sure. Um, so like the team family aspect of it is, it's kind of cliche to say family, but really like the people that you spend this amount of time with like they just become your best friends and the people you see every day and that's just something like these connections that i've made in show i've also made in tennis like some of my best friends are in both activities and now you're in an activity called bistro coming up so what is bistro so bistro is a variety show we do around valentine's day uh there's vocal jazzes show choirs and then individual acts um it's really awesome time to just show off all of the amazing things that our, our music department can do. And it's just a really good experience for our, our, uh, all of me and my friends to get to perform. Now you also have a few acts in Bistro. What is that like? Um, it's, it, it's, it's crazy. It's a lot of stress, I'm not gonna lie, but it's, it's fun getting to do this and getting to do that. Like I'm in vocal jazz, I have another act, I have a solo and show choir. It's, it's totally hectic, but I wouldn't want it any other way. And then for your final question, it will be, what is your favorite book? Um, my favorite book was when I read when I was little. It was <laughs> Because of Win dixie uh, I read it like three times in a row. I don't know why. It was just a really good book. <laughs> Thank you. Here's 30 Seconds of Nature. Here's Eva's word of the week. Ordinary. Here's the take five. So, here's this week's take five. For your first question, are you a morning person or night person? Night person, for sure. For your second question, how do you like your eggs? Scrambled. Third question, what's your favorite sitcom? Oh, Parks and Rec, 100%. Fourth question, have you ever peed in a pool? Yes. <laughs> and then your fifth and final question, if you could help an endangered species of your choice, which would you pick? Um, there's like some, this weird breed of like monkey that's being endangered and they're like really cute and they like grab on trees and stuff. Probably that, I don't know what it's called. <laughs> okay. Now I'm not sure what to make of that description of the monkey, which she's talking about, but I'm just going to say She's talking about the Emperor Tamarin. Now, the Emperor Tamarin is a very cute little monkey that climbs on trees, so, you know, that fits the description. So, I'm just going to assume it was that. And you can help out the Emperor Tamarin and many other primates on uh, WWF.org, and I really hope you do, because it's just amazing to help out wildlife like that, which just needs help. So, I really hope that you guys go and help them out. For my book recommendation this week, I'm going to be recommending this book, The Complete Far Side, Volume 1, January 1980 to January 1984, by Gary Larson. 
it's pretty much just a book of, well, uh, the comic strips from the far side uh, from, well, the dates I mentioned earlier. And yeah, it's pretty funny. They're really funny comic strips. You should definitely check them out. For my adventure this week, I had my younger sisters play Wordle. Okay, we got okay, it's A, A R. R. I know what Grace? Eva. It has to have an R and an A right oh, there. Oh, oh, oh. Rain No Cause oh. there's no I and N. Oh Eraser Rap Raps Good guess. <gasps> it is it. So it starts with an F? I'm not saying anything. It starts with an F and I'll be doing it. F, 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 F. F. Let's try F, R, A. F, R, A. R, A. F, R, A. B, N, G. F, R, I. E, N, G. F, R, I. E, N, D. That's how you spell so friend. <laughs> Signing off.